What's going on guys? Matthew from Matsby Battles and today I've got a video. Uh <coughs> I got this package from Tropical Nile and I'm super excited to open it. It actually got here very quickly, which is nice. So uh I don't really want to put any like information, so it's gonna be kinda hard. <laughs> so uh here we go. Okay, so, first thing, so, got the little thing over here, first thing we'll pull out is, oh, this is going to be amazing, it's totally wrapped, which is really good. Ugh. As you guys know, I'm very unprofessional a lot, or at least unboxing-wise, very unprofessional. It always takes me a really long time to unbox things, so, this is bound to be a bit long. Not that I'm, not that I mind. Okay, so we have a bright fluorescent yellow SW145 and SD. So yeah, so, there we go. So that's pretty cool. Like that. Right here. Next thing we're gonna pull out is a. So while I'm opening this, oh, oh wait, I got it. Never mind. Talk in a second. <laughs> I almost have it. We have a. We have a hell crown on the baseball. So that's pretty cool. I like the I like the crown. I don't have crown yet. Like I was saying, I finished watching uh, Ruby. I really, really uh. I'm gonna save that. Okay, this seems good. Uh, I'll finish watching Ruby, and that or up to season three, of course. Season four will come out sometime here in the summer. But uh, man, everybody I've talked to also agrees that season three was like terrible and killing off. Uh, what's her name? Spoilers. Sorry. Oh, Hera. It's a terrible idea. So now we have Evil Jimius. Not, of course, you know, like, this evil and stuff. Baseball definitely has got some sticker it's worn a bit, but that's okay. Because I actually needed a new baseball. Okay. Next we have this. That was really bad. Basically, the finale of that basically took all the flaws in the series. Because, I mean, it was pretty good overall, but all the flaws that were there basically took them and amplified them. And really showcased them. And I can think of a bunch of things wrong with her death in general. They're just they're bad. So we have Dark Wolf. I don't get much chance to talk to people, so about things like this. So yeah, Dark Wolf. Uh, this is a nice color. I've never really seen a wolf's color. I, I've never owned a wolf, uh, this wolf, so very happy about that. So next is we pull out parts. Oh yeah, this is a nice one. <coughs> Not gonna lie, I do feel kind of bad with this about this one. Oh, there's a little gap. And that. That's on my thumb. There we go. It's Flash Sagittario. I don't have regular Flash Sagittario, so stick in attack mode. I don't have regular Flash Sagittario. I've got the Flash Hyper Blade, so this is nice. So now we have. These parts, I'm gonna move this one down because it's just been tracking tip. So, saving that. And, here we go. With. Ooh! It's a bunch of, uh. Tips, it looks like. So, I'm gonna save that too. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing this in kind of. Because I don't want to, you know, like, spoil some things, you know, like, there's a tip with a bunch of things. Okay, next is, uh. Nightmare and Rex. So I don't have Nightmare at all. I don't have Rex at all. So I kind of kind of wanted this one. I actually spent a hundred dollars buying these days. An entire hundred dollars. So I dropped a lot of money on these. But 
but I have no problem with that because, you know, he's trying to salt to get burst, so I'm happy to help him out. So, no problem with that. Oh, uh, wait. I'm gonna open the, uh... I'll get the keys out for the, uh... Spin track, or not spin tracks, the uh, fusion ones and stuff. Go for that first. Whoa! We have a double pack, Earth Eagle, with a metal face bolt. Haha. <laughs> so another metal face bolt's awesome. And another Eagle, because Eagle is the best bay, so. Then, next is another bay I, like, legitimately needed badly. So, you know, like, sometimes you don't need the bays, you just kind of want them or something. Like, I didn't actually, I wanted, like, Nightmare X. It wasn't a must-have bay, you know. Because I already, I don't, it's not, like, super great or anything. But this one was a must. I needed this, and that is Evil Befall. Nice and shiny, basically fresh out of the package, he said. So, I think that's what it is. Or is it in the, it was in the inbox or fresh out of the box? So, Evil Befall, very nice and shiny. I needed that bait pretty badly. Then, We have almost as bonus Rock Leon. Uh, yeah, Rock Leon. <laughs> Not much else to say. Don't have Rock Leon yet. Okay, now let's open up some tracks. So, in here we have a UW 145. Oh, yes, I can. I can switch modes. My other one is got, it was from when I first got it, it was like stuck, so I can never switch modes. Yes, I can, that was awesome. Now, I need to. So my Bufal, as you can see, has the things facing downwards. So, okay, I wasn't sure. I was going to thing So I'm going to put this, like, this. I love how shiny it is. I almost want to put Jimmy's on it. <laughs> Might have to try that. Yeah, no. so I'm going to keep this in the other mode because it's, yeah. Also in that little, because he, like, wrapped all of the things, so. The other one with, came with, wrapped with it is the part of Flash Switch Terror, 230 WD. If I remember correctly, I think Eagle cost the most amount of money. E Eagle and Ball, I think, were the most expensive too. I mean, <laughs> you can see how, look how shred this tip is. It's like flat. You will see the little thing popping up there. It's like flat. How bad my condition, how bad condition it's in. Here's the group of tips. So, as you can see, so here's a wide ball. Looks like it's in the best condition. Leon was like one of the cheaper bays. I didn't mind though, because I need a Leon. WD is in not the best condition either. Not that I care. Got a bajillion WDs. Then we have flat ball, which I don't have this tip at all. Just one of the reasons I wanted to crown. Then we have the nice mint EWD. So, anybody who wants EWD for a tournament now. There is one available. And then FS. I love Jimmyos, the red that goes to Jimmyos. Such a nice color. So I'm gonna stick this onto the bay. I also have another, you can see it here, WD just sitting around. Okay, next is these two. Oh, there's something else. I don't see that. That's hard to see. Okay, broke into it. Not sure what this goes for. I can take a good guess though. So, but I'm gonna hold that to the side for a second. Kind of for sure. So we have two 145s. Actually, we have another 45. I think it's 145. It's a clear one. Looks like it goes with the tempo. I'm gonna take a guess that that is supposed to go with the uh, crown. Because I don't know what it goes with the crown. That goes with the eagle and that goes with So let me put eagle and Leon together real quick. Kind of wish I had a uh, Leon Facebook sticker to put on this. The one thing that 
No, it's not a big deal. That's the other 3D. I guess I think that's one of these should be I'm guessing. Some, some, some blocks. Okay, so I think this is wolf. I think that's the. I think Wolf originally came with uh, a really color. But I really wanted that Wolf. Uh, so, yeah, that, that clear one definitely does go with the crown for sure. For good points. I'm keeping this off camera for a reason, too. So. Here's the red downforce from Free Fire. Love the color of it. One of my favorite colors, probably my favorite or easily top three favorite colors in Beyblade is this red. So you can see, these are the bays. Spent one hundred dollars in total. Uh, yeah. But uh, you know, there is one more thing. I'm saving this for the end. Pretty sure I may just may have convinced somebody that I was not going to be getting this bay, like at all. So I decided to kind of hold it off to the side until the end. And as I open it here, the last, finally, the, la the other bay that I got, one that I think I might have convinced somebody maybe a month ago that I was never going to get, and that is. The Phoenix, and even have the clear. I'm gonna stick it in the other mode. Got the nice clear G30 GCF. There we go. So this together. Oh, just walk out there. Okay. okay, let me switch the mood. Zero G bays are paint for together. This is the first Hasbro Zero G bay I've ever touched. Well, I've owned. Yeah, Takara Tome is definitely made better, but I don't have the Phoenix at all. Because out of all the Genbol random boosters I got, I never got one of the Phoenix. I didn't get the Phoenix or the Saramanda that's the free 230. I got a ton of killer kins. I got two of one killer kin and one of another one. I got three Genbols, Shinobi Genbols. I got one Shinobi Griff and then I got the Genbol. So there we go. So let's recap. Rock Leon. One, uh, one, Rock Leon 145 wide ball. Evil the Fall. UW 145 EWD. Basically mint. Earth Eagle, Metal Face Heavy, Earth Eagle, 145 WD. Nightmare Rex, SW 145 SD. Hey, Hades Crown, 145 Flat Ball. The Phoenix, E230, GCF. Evil Gemios, Downforce 145 Flat Spike. Dark Wolf, DF 145 Flat Spike. And Flash Sagittario, 230 WD. Now, I sound so bad. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure there's other people who wanted some of these bays, so... I feel kind of bad, I totally... Because I, I think I was the first one to work out a deal. So I, like, totally sniped some of these bays, I think, from people. So I do feel sort of bad. But, uh... It's really nice having all of them, because... I don't have an actual Rock Leon. I usually just make one by myself with parts I have. A Purple Leon, usually, or my Dark Green Leon. With a... Hopefully colored. Usually no. Usually it's the orange from a 45 wide ball. My evil gym, my evil befall had this was always stuck and wouldn't come come in switch positions. And this is shredded. The tip is so poor. Never can have enough. Can never have enough eagles. I never had this bay. I never had this bay. I never thought I was even close to owning this bay. 
my face bolt is broken. Jimmy's. And my flat spike is kind of like shredded. Oh my gosh, let's tail up. Uh, I never owned regular Dark Wolf. Maybe eventually I'll get a, a reddish orange bottom. And I never had Karatomi Flash Touch Terror. I was going to buy this one actually. Uh, regular one. So. But I got a, you know, one to help him out. So, very glad to buy all of this from him. And uh, yeah, so, huge shout out to uh, Tropical Nile for being able to talk and get these worked out so I could get these as soon as possible and I could get, I guess, dibs on one of other people because we worked out pretty quickly. So that was nice. I spent quite a bit of money, like I said, on these, but I'm happy to help him out because I know he wants first. So hopefully he'll use the money well and get some really nice first, first days. And yeah. This will be the next thing I upload on my channel for sure before any card openings or anything like that. Um, be busy this weekend. I'm cleaning my room, so I barely got a space here. As you can see, I'm not going to actually show it. Maybe I'll show you guys later. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Go check out Tropical Nile on YouTube. He's made some very high quality Beyblade videos. So, if you really like good quality, awesome battles, uh, go check out his channel. He's also a really great person, so. Yeah, definitely go subscribe to him. Um, thank you for letting me buy all these. Very happy to help you get first. And yeah, if you guys enjoyed, um, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you guys later.